So I have a video response for the pot doll on things you collect. Hats. Yes, I collect hats. Um, I have about 29 hats total, I think. <clears throat> so my first hat right here, this is the very first hat I ever got. My stepdad gave it to me to be, uh, sorry, oh, for golfing, to go golfing. So I had a hat to cover my head and that. That's the first hat I have. I like it. It's a comfy hat. I wear it a lot. When I'm working and I'm not afraid to get, when I'm getting dirty, I wear this because it's dirty. It doesn't matter much. Like, say, you can see the bills all fray or whatever. This is the second cat hat I got. Again, another one of my stepdad gave me. Um, this originally was kind of like, supposed to be like my nicer hat I'd wear to go do nicer things, but that kind of, it's kind of getting old too. The bills are going to fray a little bit. Um, this is my next favorite cat. It's my new one I like to wear for a nice purpose hat. Um, yeah, then there's this one. Just another random cat hat. Then I have three more cat hats. Now, these two, this one, and this one, my stepdad all gave me. These three that are right here, my mom gave me for Christmas because she was sick of seeing me wearing this hat. It's all frayed and tears. She's like, you know, you need a nicer hat. You need to throw that away. And I'm like, no, it's comfy. I'm keeping it. <sighs> Anyways, I got my Boise State hat. Um... This particular, I say this one's up Boise State. This hat I have to wear backwards because if I don't, it like slides up my head. I got a DC beanie. I have another one that I have at work that I wear because for when it's cold or whatever, if you see me wearing it. I have a Larry the Cable Guy Get Her Done hat because I went and saw Larry the Cable Guy um, once, so that's why I have that hat. This hat a friend gave to me. I don't know. Just a hat. I got my two work hats here. Hennings Auto Salvage and Recycling. Uh, my friend from high school, his family owns the salvage yard in the town, so he gave me that hat. <clears throat> I got this hat, just a super sport. It says Chevy on the back. I don't remember where I got that. Um, this hat, Budweiser Outdoors. I actually got this in a raffle at the grocery store I used to work at. It had a raffle for a bunch of different things, and this was one of the things that they raffled. A couple of Cabela's hats. Um, this hat. This hat, this hat, this hat, and this hat are all from the grocery store I worked at. Uh, Swift Trucking Company hat. Miller Sports Center. Another one like the Budweiser Outdoor. I won that at the next year's Christmas party. That was that, yes. This one, Durango Just Center. My line manager worked there. Um, and he had the hats. I don't know why he had it, but when I first started working for work, I was wearing this hat and... The boss wasn't too happy with that, so he gave me the Durango Jessen hat to wear instead. Um, the other two hats that I have are these up here. They're just some kind of, I don't know, baller caps or something like that. Uh, I call them the guitar hats because I like to wear them when playing guitar. <laughs> this one. <laughs> I like the skulls. I got it back when I was in high school or early high school, like a freshman or something like that. But yeah, like I say, each hat here has a story, has a purpose, well, most of it anyways. But I collect hats. And as you can tell, like I see, I have one, two, three, four, five, five more slots on this thing before it's full. Well, I can count six if I move my DCB in here. But yes, that is my hat collection. It's starting to get fairly large. And I'm always adding new hats to it. Um, I would like to get my one black and yellow cat out. I'd like to get another one of it, a newer, nicer one. But I have yet to find one. So, yes, anyways, that, oh, sorry. That is my thing that I collect.